A menu passcode is a nice added security feature if you have a user who gets in and changes things without your intention. This could be that they get into vocab, choose new vocab, and select another vocabulary in the system. Or they might get in and do some page editing that you would like to prevent. The way to set this added security measure is to tap on the menu option on your blue keyboard and enter settings. And you'll see each grouping of settings is headed with a, a gray header. So we have profiles, the navigation tools, page size tools. You want to find that fourth group for editing. And you see there's two options there. The first one is for us to enter a menu passcode. So we're going to tap there. I'd like to use something that's not easily guessable. So one, two, three, four, five, six is a, a bad option. Zero, 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 zero is a bad option but also something that team can remember well. So very often I'll use a school zip code. Students don't tend to know those off the top of their heads. So it's something that you can easily share and, and look up if you need to. So we're gonna go ahead and plug in the zip code for my office, 15120. So that allows you to set the code and this can be numbers or letters. There's no uh, limit to the quantity of those characters either, uh, but you do have to have something, uh, at least one character. But this still doesn't actually do the protection until we select that second option for use menu passcodes. We're going to go ahead and tap that to activate it, and now we can hit done. What that's done now is that blue toolbar has a password protection on it now. So if I try to go into vocabulary to change to a different user, it's going to prompt me to enter that passcode before I can do that. One, five, one, two, zero. And now I can hit choose new vocab and make the change. Same thing with the menu option in the blue toolbar. The passcode prop comes before it will display any options. The one thing to keep in mind with any passcodes, whether you're using guided access or in this case, the menu passcode within LAMP is not to enter that within the student's line of sight. If they see it and learn it, it's defeated the purpose of setting it. So make sure to uh, avert the gaze of the, the user while you're entering this so that this protection can remain in force. Here I'll enter 15120. Now I can access any of these menu options. In this case, I'm going to turn my menu passcode off. And now that protection is no longer there. You'll note that I did not remove the passcode though. So sometimes when I'm gonna do a bunch of page editing, it's just convenient for me to toggle that green button off so I can get into the menus as frequently as I need. And then when I'm all done with my editing, I just turn that active again and the menu passcodes back and forth. For now, I'm gonna go ahead and leave that off, choose done, and know that if I need it, it's always there for me to access. Thank you.